Right. It was at this moment that he knew. Oh, yeah, yeah, son of a bitch. You know what we're filming today? Not really, but what do we usually do when we do this? What do you call the uh, like reaction? You know, all your dumb things. TikTok. Okay, <laughs> okay. So I picked out a few food TikToks. I'm gonna get your reaction to it. Ready? Yeah. Okay, ready? First one. Can I get the title away for you guys? I know, I'm still working on it. Can I get the title away for you guys? It's so fun, see, I'm still working on it. Can I get the title away for you guys? No, just the one piece of my chart. No, I'm Chinese idol with food. American food. Can I get the title away But you know, it's funny. Mm -hmm. The way she waved her hand is so American. It's like, don't do this to me. <laughs> Chinese restaurant run by white people to the caption. Yeah, but she's doing her job. She's being polite, right? Yeah, she's being polite. She wanted to clear the plate. But when you're in the Chinese restaurant, when the plate is not really empty, you just <laughs> don't go there. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. You know, I like those cultural differences because it's so different. And actually, if you know the other side or the other side, it's actually very funny. something really really fun so we're just gonna go one two three four wow doesn't that look good now we're gonna get the next step ready right in here and we're gonna whisk it together have you ever done this before perfect want it to open so seam side down Butter. follow me Holy cow. Okay. Oh my gosh, open that. Open Look it up. How beautiful open it up right now. Is it good? Oh my gosh. Look! <laughs> <laughs> the egg is perfectly done. The egg is yeah, put it in a little bit. <laughs> I thought the idea was so great to mold it because I like, you know, things are kind of perfect. Yeah. And I think, oh, using a wine glass. When she was flipping over, I like that part of it because you can really make it into a pocket, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> How well, I didn't get it. What was the point? <laughs> to not break the egg or something? I, I, I think she just doesn't know. I think she just, hey, you know what? The, you know, I got a great idea, but you know, actually, you know, when Someone you- Someone said you need rehab. <laughs> <laughs> you need therapy, right? Yeah. That's funny. That's really funny though. Thumbs up or thumbs down? Uh, Wasting food? No, I think the humor is awesome. I think it's really awesome. You know what? Sometimes you cannot just always make like perfect things, right? I think something to try, the fail is, is success. Hold on, please. First up, office assistant Andrew and purchasing supervisor Jimmy. Jimmy, what's it like to be slim? You definitely can't hear me. Okay, good. Wow. Ready? You can't hear Talking anything. to a chubby person. Oh my god. Jimmy, don't eat my fingers. Jimmy always okay. the They both really kind have of got like chicken in their mouths. Easier, straightforward. Feels like chicken, tastes like chicken. What is it? Chicken. Mm -hmm. It tasted like a um, meat tortellini with a bit of sweated onions in the background. Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> that was chicken, you twat. Okay. Hey, you know what? It's, it's not easy when people actually, you know, doing food tasting, it's a take blind your tasting. Senses away. It completely take your sense away. Especially, especially when you don't have good experiences. Mm -hmm. So it's all about memories, right? Food tasting, blind tasting, Sweated uh, onion. Sweated <laughs> onion with the tortellini. I think I think he's a little bit like trying a bit too hard. Yeah. I think he's got really beaten Gordon up. Ramsay. Yeah. Uh, don't bite my finger. <laughs> <laughs> he probably couldn't say. He doesn't say these jokes in nowadays. Oh really no! Good. This is like in the early, yeah. probably in the early nineties. I didn't hear that one when we went to uh, England when we want to uh, to see a soccer game. That was almost like what eight years ago. Mm -hmm. And this guy in front of you. You fucking twat! <laughs> what does your full day of eating to stay shredded year round really look like? All of these macros, calories, and meals are specific to me. Please do not try to copy what I do meal for meal and expect the same results. Experiment for yourself. I want to see, see what, what gets he you eats. dice up. Breakfast. Really? Kickstart my day with five whole pasture raised eggs, 425 calories. Give me those good old. How many eggs again? And 150. Five eggs. 
grams of wild Alaskan sockeye salmon, 256 calories, and fill it for them, of course. Gotta get that good vitamin B12. Lunch, beat that midday craft with one egg, 85 calories. You know I love them. Six ounces of delicious, tender, fatty, grass-fed steak. Ribeye, of course, 330 calories. Three ounces of scrumptious sardines, 161 calories. You know you love them. Topped off with 100 grams of shrimp, 100 calories. That's straight protein, my guy. Dinner, finish the night right with some more of them eggs, 255 calories. Four ounces of canned, <laughs> ready-to-go salmon, 165 calories. And five ounces of grass-fed, grass-finished ground blue. 298 calories. Total the day out at 2,073 calories, 128.4 grams of fat, 213.5 grams of protein, and 8.5 trace carbs. That's my full day of eating to get peeled. Drop a like for more, and I'll see you all next time. I tell you, it's not about eating. It's not about like, like enjoying eating. It's all about just power protein. I worked out, I want muscles. Oh, not muscle. Muscles. And I want protein. Muscles like the food or muscles? Muscles, yeah. So <laughs> anyhow. It's just like, okay, it's not enjoyable at all. You think on. you could do that? If I, oh, that would be punishment. I mean, you know, okay, let's put it this way. You know, there are other countries, don't, people don't have food. When you see something like that, I think this is not right. And I, I know you like to work out, but I think you need to be a little bit more humble yourself a bit, I would say. Would He's you never had sugar in four years, this guy. Which is a good thing. I, I, give, him, I give him thumbs up. But... He never done a cheat day either, he said. Thumbs up or thumbs down? I would give him the, a little bit of this. All right, we got a little cicada wash. What the fuck is that? Oh my God, cicada this batter. is moving. Now for the, oh, a little fry job going on. And for the taste test, a little fried cicada. Oh, cicada, okay, okay, okay. Now, and I'm getting it. Well, you know, okay. Back in Hong Kong when I was a kid, they used to sell, they call them wong bei long. Like a cicada, but black. And they salted in uh, uh, some salt. They, we, we, they used to sell them on the street. You can buy them. You can eat it. Just pop would it you in your eat mouth. It? Yes, of course I would. So would you try this? Yes, absolutely. No problem at all. You know, I think we just not getting used to like open up our mind. Other culture like the Mexicans, you know uh, this? Africans, uh, Asians. They they eat. They discover a lot because don't forget those, those are very old culture. I think this is something that guy we saw earlier should be eating this instead of like eggs, steaks, eggs, steaks, steaks and eggs. I have a bad reaction in the beginning because I was I saw them running around, but oh, of course. Oh, they dip in egg, mm -hmm. you see? Even a little bit more protein. With egg, a little bit of that cicada, I can see a little spices taste good, yeah. So this is fruit roll up and butter. The fruit roll up, and the butter is frozen. I had it in the freezer overnight. I always do that. This is vinegar and tahini. Super good, super good. So dip it, dip it, dip it, and so juicy. <laughs> Look at her face. Little combo snack. I don't know. Oh, oh, no. so good. Butter with roll up. Is, is a, what is roll up? Is that a really soft kind of candy that you unroll? Oh, oh, is it actually, it's not, it's not chewing gum, right? It's almost like that texture. Yeah, it's like a... Uh... Roll up with butter? Super good, super good. <laughs> so, dip it, dip it, dip, dip it, dip it. Oh my God. Oh, yummy, right? Yeah, yeah, oh so yeah. Juicy. Oh yeah, <laughs> juicy. Where the hell it comes from, the juicy bar? We went yeah. to the carnival. Carnival, that's it. And you got me fried butter? Yeah. And I was like, Dad, try it. Yeah, and then you know what happened, right? Or, you, did you keep it in your mouth? I keep it in mouth for a while. And then when I saw a garbage can, when he walks in front of me, I <laughs> I just like spit it out. And I was so mad at him because I wanted to try it. No, I did try it, but I did not swallow it. <laughs> You know, I don't know who. Okay, there is somebody really young. This kid yeah. probably grew up with grandma. That's grandmother, right? I don't know what their relationship is. Yeah, I, I think it has to be. Looks so sad, but tastes so good. I <laughs> love like it. It's just so non, like you know, grandmother love. You know what I mean? That is the catch part of it. It's so funny. Mmm. I already kind of know this, know, know about what it is.
What is that? Okay, that's called Nato. It's like a fermented soy. Yeah, one of my favorite. And I think this young woman, I think she kind of know this food. I think she could be, yeah, she's half Japanese. You see her last name, mm -hmm. Mariko. So, you know, like she grows up, grow up on this. Like something like that. This kind of food, you know, if you taste it the first time, not from the culture, you probably not like it because I have experimented many of my friends. But you get hooked. This stuff we really crave. Especially when you travel to Japan, you what know. What is it? Well, soy bean. natto, soybean being fermented is so good for your stomach. I, I used to love eating that in the, for breakfast with rice and even with a little quail egg mixed in with a little bit of soy sauce, a little bit of sisal leaf. Mmm, yummy. So thumbs up? Thumbs up. I love this for breakfast. I love this for dinner. A little bit like this first. Sure. Does she have a. Uh, what do you call that? Like a like a yeah. like a karate yeah. outfit? That is you know? crazy. I don't understand. How? Yeah. Mush it. Mush it. Oh, mush somebody it. mush it? Okay. Yeah, mush the eggs are falling off. So I don't know how to. <laughs> Why are you? This is. I need better direction. A little bit like this. So what is she trying to do? Make pasta? Yeah, she she so does. What's she doing wrong? Uh, well, first of all, the wrong thing is like she should just take off the damn cutting board. Just leave it on the table. And I think, you know what? She does not have a chef hand. <laughs> chef hands is the key making pasta. So, or you know- being too like- smart. Yeah, too gentle on it. I, I think, you know what? She was worried about breaking the egg yolks and she's just kind of like massaging the egg yolk instead of like binding everything together. Mm -hmm. You know, your hands as a chef hands, it's like a whisk. It's like a claw, a clamp, a tweezer, and also extension of your hand. So this is like, I think this is something she gotta learn. I, I, I have to give it to her, her first try, you know. You know, I think it's a good experience. I think making, it's such a satisfying thing, making like pasta dough, when you're actually making into a sheets of noodle, and then you boil it and you put a sauce on, it's like, wow. Mm -hmm. It's very sad. It's like making bread, very similar. All right, so what did you think of all the food TikToks? I, I did like it. I, I learned some stuff. Really made me laugh, I have to say, is the, uh, you know, the raw chicken in the cup. Yeah. <laughs> that was pretty funny. That really, you know, made my day for that one. <laughs> raw chicken with raw egg. You know, it's like when they're presenting it, Oh, he's like, look, it's gonna be really nice. One cut and the raw egg will fall out yeah. and the chicken is completely raw. Uh, good humor, I love it. Thank you. Uh, if you like this video, please subscribe to your new channel. To my new channel, press the button. Like, subscribe, notification, bell. Okay, go slower. Like, like button. Like button. Subscribe button. Sub subscribe button. Notification bell. Bell. Yeah, like a little bell. Oh, I hit it. And oh, Nova, 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 <laughs> Notification. No, no, the Nova, Nota, Nota, Vacation. Nota, Notification. So, like, Notification. No, 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 Notification bell. Hit the button and subscribe. For more content, check out my video. Press the button if you like it and subscribe. And. Nova the Cape, no vac, no, no to, no to vacation, no, yes, oh, no to vacation, bell, Nova, no, fuck, I can't do this today, just think of notified, oh, no to, no, but, uh, no, it's the, the tongue and the lips can't move, no, notification bell, no vacation bell, yeah. no, no, no vacation bell, they, they got it. Thank you.